Hi everybody, I am Dr. Ashtosh Kumar, Clinical Director, Cardiac Electrophysiology at KR Hospital, Hyderabad. Uh, today I am going to discuss regarding EP study RF ablation. This is one of the most advanced uh, uh, technology which we use for treatment of arrhythmia patient. Arrhythmia means heart beating related issues whenever it is there. We have to pinpoint the reason and later on by the RF energy we can ablate and sometimes cure also. So in the brief, it is an electrical study of the heart and how we do it. So like if you are aware, this is a minimally invasive procedure, means we are taking the root of the veins and through that we are going to position three catheters in different location of the heart and we check the normal electrical circuit, means how the current is flowing. As you know that heart is having its own electrical system, so it is having its own generator and transmitter system and current will be flowing in a particular direction. So if there is any short circuit or we can say abnormal circuitry in the heart, it will give uh, origin to this arrhythmia problem or beating related issues. So we put three catheters in three locations and after that we start giving the computerized protocol for checking out whether any abnormal circuit is there in the heart or not. And after locating that particular location, we just give a RF energy of 30 to 60 seconds and it get ablated or we can say the, the disease is cured also in some, some of the conditions. Now coming to uh, uh, type means usually there are conventional in which conventional EP study in which we are just keeping the x-ray or we can say fluoroscopy guided means we are just totally focusing the catheter by the x-ray system and making the mapping of the arrhythmia circuit and ablating it. This was the older way of doing the ablation still uh, been practiced in most of the center but there are advanced system because a 3d system in which we are putting the uh, patches around the heart and we can very pinpointed the millimeter by millimeter without giving radiation we can pinpoint the abnormal circuit of the heart and we can give rf energy and ablation so we call it a 3d mapping of the arrhythmia means beating related issue and by, by the same rf energy we can ablate so in this type of procedures, uh, our uh, what you call uh, resolution of the heart um, abnormal circuit is a bit higher, radiation is less and it is more safer way or more pinpointed way to know the arrhythmia and its location. How is the hospital course? Usually it is a two, uh, one to two hours procedures depending upon the time in the circuit. It may last for four or five hours in some, some of the uh, very complex circuits. And patient has to stay for one day and later on he can do, he can be discharged and we promote the patient that he should go and be more active so that the risk of DVT, deep venous thrombosis will be less. So it is more like a non -in a minimally invasive procedure in which we are just keeping the wire inside the heart, knowing the abnormal circuit and ablating it. There are 2D and 3D type of system means 2D means conventional fluoroscopy guided and 3D means we are having the patches by which without giving the radiation we can map and come out. So whenever EP study comes, uh, you, you should always choose what is best for you and the center and get your treatment done for the arrhythmia. Thank you.